Now this tells us something, something about the relation between the, between the electric field and the potential and that will be useful in computing many a times electric field graphically, okay, okay. Now the first thing that it says is, is what is the direction of the electric field? What is the direction of the electric field? It is that direction, see, it is that direction. Suppose I have, I have these as a cross section of, say, say this is an equivalent say this is another equivalential circuit, okay, say this is another equivalential circuit, okay, let us say, let us say, and someone asks me, say, say this is, this is 10, this is 20, obviously volts, this is 30, okay, and someone asks me, what is the direction of electric field at this point? Okay. What is the direction of electric field at this point? Okay. How do I find that out? What will be the direction of electric field at this point? It will be it will be first of all perpendicular to this, right? That much I am aware. Okay, it has to be perpendicular to this. Why? Because all electric fields are perpendicular to, all electric fields are perpendicular to the equipotential surfaces or all equipotential surfaces are perpendicular to the electric fields, right? Now what? Now what? Look, I can say if, if I am at this point, it is not this, it is not this, it is also not this, it has to be this. Why? It says it is del V upon del L. It is the direction in which the, the, the potential falls the fastest or increases the fastest with respect to the distance. What is del L? This is del L. Why? Why that is del L? Because that has to be the perpendicular to both. Okay, if it is perpendicular to both of the surfaces, then that is the shortest distance. Understand? If del L is shortest, then del V upon del L is the highest. Okay? Okay? So, so, the, so the first conclusion we draw from this is, that electric field is in a direction direction in which the the potential the potential what happens to the potential? The potential falls the fastest, is it not? What is the direction? Direction will have to be this, right? Potential falls the fastest with respect to the distance, you see? See, if, if I go through the path 1, what happens? Del V is the same. Del V is 
20 minus 10 that is 10. What is the length of the path? Okay, it is more than this del L. So the potential gradient with respect to with respect to the distance is lesser here in path 1. Okay, in path 2, in path on path 2, del V is the same, del this length is less than this. So here the potential gradient is higher than for path 1. Yeah. Right? That's what. So the so the so that so that distance in which that 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 path along which the del V upon del L is the maximum. Because del L is the minimum. Okay. That is the, the direction in which the del V upon del L is the maximum. And what is the second thing? What is the second thing? Its magnitude is equal to, so the direction is set, the magnitude, the magnitude of the electric field equals, equals the ratio of the change in potential upon the distance moved, okay? equals the rate of change of the potential per unit per unit displacement normal to displacement normal to normal to the per unit displacement normal to the to the plane of the equipotential surface normal to the plane of the equipotential surface at the given point okay equipotential surface at the given point we understand so this okay now let us let us try doing this for for a point charge at a distance r At a distance r, if, if, if this is a positive charge, then this is how the field is, right? What is the potential here? This is equal to q upon 4 pi epsilon naught r. Okay? Okay, fine. So, what is dv upon dr? dv upon dr is minus q upon 4 pi epsilon naught r square. Okay, is mod of dv upon dr not equal to the mod of e this is what is it not if it would have been potential energy then you would have seen the minus dv upon dr would have become a force that draws from class 11th right okay 
will soon come to that if there is an electric field or d and you put something here what happens to the potential what happens to the potential energy in the presence of an external electric field fine understand 